appreciate y'all coming out and supporting Gospel Night at the Russ County Fair. We sure have enjoyed ourselves. Didn't the Jesse family do a good job? Cressman Quartet did a good job. How about the principals? They did a wonderful job. I thought we had a great lineup tonight. I hope you've enjoyed some of this singing that you got to take part in tonight. It's a, just a blessing to, to be able to come out in a nation where men have fought and died, men and women. To give us this right, I tell you, it really means a lot to me. Most of all, the death of our Lord and Savior upon the cross of Calvary. And on that third and glorious morning, the stone was rolled away, and He come out of there alive and well, and He's coming back for me and you. Do we have any veterans in the crowd tonight? I see a few. Won't you stand for us? These men went and fought the battles, and we could do this tonight. Give them a big hand. Thank you so much for your service, man. Thank you so much. Oh, they're sounding good back here. These boys right here, Jeff. Uh, I, I, I went to Hominy Valley for about 30 years, every July the 4th week spent time and vacation down there other than if we had a family emergency or something like that come along and I just enjoyed the, the time at Hominy Valley the Premier Quartet I remember before Jeff was with them when they had little Charlie Chandler yeah I was coming to Hominy Valley then and Jeff I remember one one year Norman hurt his knee playing softball I believe it was yeah. maybe and he got on stage up there and he tried to sit down. Well, he did sit down in those little plastic chairs and that thing come out from under him too. I mean, Norman Wilson fell flat on his back. <laughs> and he said, children, I've fallen and I can't get up. <laughs> you remember that, Jeff? Oh, yeah, that was him. <laughs> hey, would y'all put your hands together and make welcome here at Russell County Fair, Jeff Talbert and Primitive Road from Candler, North Carolina. <laughs> The Lord's presence all around Can you feel the Holy Spirit coming down Just forget your earthly cares While His glory fills the air There's no better time than now to praise the Lord There's no better time then now to praise the Lord Just look up Get your minds in one accord Lift your hands in humble praise And He'll bless in many ways There's no better time Than now to praise the Lord Give someone a friendly smile And the Lord will make your efforts worth your while Now all together loud and strong Let's join in and sing this song There's no better time than now to praise the Lord There's no better time then now to praise the Lord Just look up and get your minds in one accord Lift your hands in humble praise And He'll bless in many ways There's no better time than now to praise the Lord Lift your hands in humble praise And now to praise the Lord. How's everybody doing in Castlewood, Virginia tonight? 
good to be here. Jesus told his disciples of things to come, that he would be persecuted. The Son of Man would die on the cross, but he wouldn't stay dead, and he won't stay gone, and he didn't stay dead, and he won't stay gone, for Jesus is coming to take us home. By his blood he has bought me, his has bought and me. his word he has taught me, his word he, has taught me. he didn't stay dead, and he won't stay gone. Now in the Bible we're told that he surely shall come. Like a thief in the night With the trump of God The King of all kings Who paid the call Didn't stay dead And he won't stay gone And he didn't stay dead And he won't stay gone Aren't you glad? Jesus is coming to take us home. By his blood he has bought me. And his word he has taught me. His word he has taught me. He didn't stay dead. And he won't stay gone. And he didn't stay dead. And he won't stay gone. Won't stay gone. Jesus is coming to take us home. By his blood he has bought me. And his word he has taught me. He didn't stay dead. And he won't stay gone. He didn't stay dead. And he won't stay gone. Won't stay gone. It's certainly good for us to be here tonight. Thank y'all for coming out and being with us. I pray that we can sing or say something or do something this evening that would point you to Christ in some way. Realizing tonight that we're helpless without His touch and honored to be here. I think all the groups did such a great job already. I felt the Spirit here this evening. Appreciate what I can feel. Listen to the words of this right here. If we can pattern our lives in some way in this walk of life. God help us to live for Him. Without the Lord, my life would have no meaning. For He holds my tomorrows in His hands. And you will find Him in all my conversation. As He leads me safely through this troubled land and when i talk i want to talk about jesus he keeps my cup filled up to the brim and when i walk i want to walk in his footsteps and while i I 
the one that truly loved him. It makes me want to try to be just like them. And when I read of his love, his grace, and his mercy, it gives me strength to want to live just for him. Sleep, I want to dream about heaven, and when I sing, I want to sing just for Him. And when I feel, I want to feel His Holy Spirit. And while I live, I want to live just for Him. It's been two thousand years ago God sent His Son to die for those That would believe He died for sin And rose from the dead He came to this earth, suffered and died On the cross was crucified Oh, what love He gave all He had For a pearl of great price Oh, glory to God, I'm on my way Going to a better place We'll walk and talk with saints of all Oh, won't it be sweet We'll stand with Peter, James, and John Singing the victory is won When he purchased that day at Calvary The pearl of great price Oh, I love this John saw the heavens opened up A man with his vesture dipped in blood That was Jesus standing there Who gave all he had Father will say, go get your bride. She's made herself ready, all robed in white. The church is the pearl and Jesus God's son who paid the great price. Oh, glory to God, I'm on my way, going to a better place. We'll walk and talk with saints of old. Oh, won't it be sweet? We'll stand with Peter, James, and John Singing the victory is won When he purchased that day at Calvary The pearl of great price Well, I love that Thankful for the pearl of great price this evening. So good to be with you, and thank y'all for coming out. I know when Brother Wayne called me there about coming back, and I was so excited. Uh, many, many years we stood on this stage and sang, and many of y'all, it's good to see so many familiar faces, and we appreciate you so much. We love you. All the guys are doing great at home. Uh, I talked to Mike on the phone a while ago, and he said, tell everybody that, uh, that they love you dearly and miss you that everybody's enjoying their lives and, and, and doing things with their family. And uh, we don't really see each other a whole lot anymore. Seems like we're all so busy, but uh, they're doing great. And uh, I'm thankful for 50 years of the ministry that uh, God bless the Primitive Quartet. And I was honored to be almost 30 years a part of that. And a uh, bunch of great guys. And uh, we're just trying our best. A lot of times people say, what are you gonna do, Jeff? And I said, well, at that particular time, I really didn't know and uh but with a lot of prayer and seeking the lord and i knew that i wanted to sing and continue to do what i was doing as much as i could but uh, it seemed like god has really opened up a lot of doors and blessed us so uh it's really exciting for jeff Robert primitive road to 
to bring new music and also to try to do our best to keep some of these old songs alive as well. So many of these songs that we do tonight, I'm sure you'll probably remember some of them along the way. But uh, this big guy standing over here beside of me to my right and your left, we're tickled to have him to be a part of what we're doing. And uh, he comes from Sweetwater, Tennessee, doing a fine job on the bass and singing tonight. And I will say this before I introduce everybody, one of the guys that are, is missing tonight, but uh, we were coming home uh, Saturday night on the road and we had a baby. We did. He was actually FaceTiming his wife and we were trying our best to get him home, but Skylar Coffee and his wife, uh, Grace, uh, they had a little baby girl named Elizabeth Beth. Is that Elizabeth Ann. Elizabeth Ann. And she was seven pounds and one ounce. And both are very healthy and uh, we just give God the glory for that and thankful for that. Yeah. But, uh, Skyler wanted me to apologize on his behalf about not being able to be here, but he's at home with his wife, and I don't blame him. That's where I'd be, too. Uh, but uh, anyway, this guy standing over here, the big guy, he comes from Sweetwater, Tennessee. His name is Mitch Gallion. Y'all make Mitch welcome. He dropped his pick. Yeah, I heard something go click, 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 and bam, it went right down just like going like sticking a dime in a slot machine. He dropped his guitar pick. And I give you that pig. That was a high dollar pig. You're fired. Can't have nothing nice. You'll have to work four weekends to be able to get that pig paid back <laughs> off. Oh my goodness, so we're missing a pig. Uh, Wayne, I don't know if you're around, if you got an extra pig. You got one? That's pretty pig. I like that. It's all kinds of different colors. That's nice. You got it? Anyway, I heard it hit, and these pigs are like. They're kind of, I shouldn't say that, they're kind of illegal, they're tortoiseshell, and uh, they're very expensive. Yeah, I know you lost it, I heard it go down the drain. <laughs> but uh, this young fella standing to my left and your right, we're honored to have him to be a part of Jeff Talbert Primitive Road, and he's doing a fine job. Many of you might look at his face or might see him and say, man, he kind of looks familiar. Well, if you're familiar with the Inspirations Quartet, the young tenor singer that sings uh, tenor there in the group. Uh, his name is Isaac Moore. Well, this is his brother and uh, Elisha is 16 years old. When he came with us, he was 15. He shaved twice and cut both legs. He's got his driver's license and now he can't hold on to his guitar pick, but other than that, he's moving on up in the world. So y'all make Elisha Moore welcome this evening. Now back to a serious note. Are y'all fixed over there? Elisha does a great job on this song, and uh, many of you, like I talked about a while ago, that know our quartet, uh, may remember this song. And uh, I'm, I can honestly say this evening that uh, my Lord is more precious than my next breath, and He's more precious than my next step. He gave us the gift of life that we might trust Him, and He gave us that in what is called eternity. And I'm thankful to know that I've been born again and saved and an old one these days. I'm just passing through here. We're just enjoying a little bit of this right now and what we're doing, but we're just passing through. And I'm glad one day I get to go home and he's more precious than gold to me. Listen to the words of this right here. Okay. Mm -hmm. And love such 
testifying about the Lord Jesus Christ, which happens to be my Savior, then I don't want to leave there without feeling the Spirit. Do y'all like to feel the Spirit of God? Amen. Now, that wouldn't have been possible unless it had been for a Monday night back in Tennessee at a little old town called Nyota. Nyota. At a church called Union Met Men Baptist Church. And friends, I walked into that church very, very troubled. But I didn't walk out troubled. And the Lord came and saved me that night, and I thank God for that. How many of you know the Lord as your personal Savior? Raise your hand. Isn't it good to know Him? Amen. Now, friends, some of y'all couldn't raise your hands. I've got good news for you. Friends, He dealt with my heart. I was in trouble. And thanks be to God. He had mercy on me. He had grace on me, and he was long-suffering. But friends, I'm going to tell you, I felt like if I were to walk out of that church that night, that'd been it for me. But I'm glad I didn't do that. And I'm glad I've got a place there in Nyota. And I pray that tonight, this might be your place if you don't know the Lord and save you. Amen. Do this old song, it's entitled, I've Got Something to Share. The Savior looked down and saw me a sinner in mercy, spoke to my heart. He saved my poor soul and lifted my burdens and gave me a brand new start. Now I've got something to show about, heaven's my eternal home. That wonderful place where I'll live forever, never again to roll. and tears are gone. I've got something to shout about. I mean to make heaven my home.
cross that chilly dark water But Jesus will be at my side To pilot my soul to heaven's bright portals Forever with loved ones above Now I've got something to shout about Heaven's my eternal home That wonderful place where I'll live forever Never again to roll and tears are unknown. I've got something to shout about. I need to make heaven my home. I've got something to shout about. I need to make heaven my home. Good job, Lars. And he says, child, I know you're sorry for all that you have done. Just reach to me, for I am the one. I am the one who died on the tree. And I Beside this good looking young man. Oh, I came as they do their next song here. Maybe somebody here is lost and don't know the Lord. And I'd like to give you an opportunity. You'd come and give your heart and life to the Lord. If you don't know Jesus, you need Him more than you need anything in this world. You need Jesus more than you need your next breath because eternity is real and you'll spend it somewhere. You'll spend it either in heaven or in hell. But you cannot stay here. If you don't know the Lord, would you please come? We'll, we'll pray with you. We'll get down. We'll get right out here in this sand right here. We'll pray with you. 
As I look back across All the years of my life I've made many choices Some wrong and some right But then one day by God's mercy I saw my sin and the cross It was the best thing that ever happened It was the day I got lost Without a doubt the best thing That's ever happened to me was on the day I got lost and I fell on my knees. It was the day Jesus saved me and He adopted me. He wrote my name in heaven and He forgave all my sins. Now I still make mistakes Along this good old way You feel the Lord drawing your mind Like Paul the Apostle You ought to come to this altar and pray We'll make an altar right here I have to die every day But the sweet Holy Spirit Sees I'm never alone And he's reminding me daily I'm no longer mine Without a doubt the best thing That's ever happened to me Was on the day I got lost and I fell on my knees. It was the day Jesus saved me. And He adopted me. And He wrote my name in heaven. And He forgave all my It was the day Jesus saved me And He adopted me He wrote my name in heaven And He forgave all my sins thankful for that. Why don't you hang tight right there just a second before you go anywhere. I'm, anytime you get an opportunity to be able to stand and brag on the Lord but when it comes time to reverence Him and give someone a chance to maybe come to know the Lord. You know we live in a world right now that's just it's a mess. And you know the sweet part about it is the world don't have anything to give me or offer me. But He gave me something in 1979 that I never will forget. He came to where I was and He gloriously saved my soul. Made me to realize I was lost and dying and going to hell. Best decision I ever made. God has blessed me with a wonderful family. Man, 30 years with the quartet as I spoke about. Many other groups that we've traveled with and now blessing me with these guys and to be able to do what we're doing. This is not a job to us. We get to do this. I'm very, very thankful for that. I just want to say I love the Lord and I'm thankful for His love this evening. He's good to us. He's worthy to be praised and lifted up. That's for sure. Wayne, well, reason why I don't want you to go to Rome, you can get your man. Help me out here. I'm going to put Wayne on the spot right here. His blood pressure just went up.
Memphis, and they're so excited down there that we're going to play the mandolin. You hear them down there hollering? They've even got their horses out. I'd like to hear a little bit of mandolin playing. Yeah. In the key of D, I think you can find it. Since uh, Skylar's not with us this evening, uh, Elisha brought it to my attention that uh, he can sing some of these songs, so we haven't really rehearsed this, but oh well. He can do it. We were, we were getting ready the other day, and uh, I was doing something other than this, that, and the other. He said, can I borrow your hair dryer? <laughs> now why is that funny? I don't know, do you? <laughs> so anyway, I did. I let him borrow my hair dryer. And he had this look on his face of like, <clears throat> okay. I thought people with no hair didn't need one. <laughs> this is my story, this A and B, you see your way out. <laughs> so anyway, I let him borrow my hair dryer. He goes back there and he primps for 30, 40 minutes or whatever else. He comes back and he brings it to me. And I said, well, it took you long enough. He said, well, he, he said, uh, I've never seen a, a hair dryer this small before. He said, it's very little. I said, yeah, it's a travel hair dryer. And he said, he said, uh, looks like to be a little hair, little hair dryer. <laughs> Needless to say, he don't borrow my dryer no more. But... <laughs> Yes, you do. Yeah, you got in it the other day, didn't you? But anyway, we have a lot of fun on the road. You know, it's great that God's, God's people can have fun and enjoy enjoy times like that. And uh, it's such a blessing to travel with these guys. And uh, we uh, sometimes it ain't always fun, some of those late nights and things like that. But for the most part, uh, it's good to travel with a bunch of good guys and, and uh, have a little fun from time to time. But uh, this is a song here that's in the key of C. 
This is an old song that takes you way back. See if you can remember this. It's entitled, I'm Leaving It All in the Hands of the Lord. Not the things that I want. Not the things that I want. But the things that I need. But the things that I need. This must be my desire. This must be my desire. If the Savior would need. If the Savior would need. So in faith I resolve. So in faith I resolve. Fully trusting His word. Fully trusting His word. And I'm living it all. In the hands of the Lord, in the hands of the Lord, and I'm leaving it all. I'm leaving it all in the hands of the Lord. Treasures cannot, earthly treasures cannot bring contentment within. Bring contentment within. This soul comes from God. This soul comes from God, the forgiver of sin, the forgiver of sin, as an army for Christ, as an army for Christ. Let us work in accord. Let us work in accord. Ever leaving it all. sing that song since May. Uh, we come off the cruise this year and had a terrible call about my mom not feeling well and being sick and it seemed like we stayed in the hospital for many, many uh, days there. And I was uh, listening to Linda talk a while ago about losing loved ones. And we battled for a long time there in the hospital. Me and my wife would go back and forth and try my best to take care of my mom. And mom was in her right mind. That was what really broke my heart. I told my wife the other day, I was just like, you know, the saddest part for me was is to know that she was in her right mind. She knew that she couldn't get better physically. And to take those steps of going into that situation. But you know what? Even in that, being that said, through the whole time, Mom would raise her hand and she'd praise the Lord. And she'd say, thank you, Lord, for being so good to me and allowed me to have a wonderful family. God, you've been so good to me. They'd say, Miss Phyllis, we're going to have to do this procedure. She'd say, well, that's all right. She said, because God's got me and everything's going to be okay. And through all of that, I don't know what in the world I would have done if I hadn't had the hand of God to help us through all that. See, you might be here tonight and you might be facing a lot of different things. These hands, your mind, and everything else can't fix it, can't do anything about it. When you get in that situation, you can pray to an almighty God to know that He is in control of it all, and we can leave it in His hands. What a blessing that is. Sing that second verse one more time. Will you? Earthly treasures cannot. Earthly treasures cannot bring contentment within. 
bringing him but they did. That alone comes from God. Sins, the negator of sin has an army for Christ, has an army for Christ. Let us work in a court, let us work in a court. Everything it all in the hands of the Lord. In the hands of the Lord, I'm leaving. Hasn't this been a good evening? Everybody's done such a great job. We won't sing you to death or keep you out too long. Just one or two in the morning. Hey Jeff, for once, Jimmy Hobbs don't have four or five hours to trip, get back home, do you? Yeah. yeah, Jimmy Hobbs, you're home tonight, aren't you? Jimmy's home. Jimmy, he comes out to a lot of singings, and it's always good to see him there and see his smiling face. Appreciate his support through the years and coming out to be with us. This is a song here. You might remember this one. It's an old one, too. It's in the lowest family. We're going to uh, 
do you an up-tempo song here that we've done for many, many years. Why don't we do this? If the principals and all the all the other groups, all you guys, if y'all come up here in the back, I want y'all to come up and join us with the last song, if you will. And uh, before we do this song, I want to say uh, we just finished up uh, in August of this year. Uh, many of you may have seen it on Facebook, but it's a it's a, a an event that we have over in the mountains of North Carolina. It's called uh, the Mountain Homecoming. And uh, we have the Inspirations with us and uh, Jeff Talbert Primitive Road. We have many speakers like Joe Arthur, uh, Coy Adams, Chad Edwards, Brian Simmons. And we just have worship services during the day. We have singing at night. It's all inclusive with lodging and food. And uh, those dates for next year will be August the 14th through the 17th. And uh, you can look us up on Facebook to find that information. And uh, we'll be posting more of that out. Y'all, if you get a chance, might want to come over and be with us in the summer. We'd love to have you. We've also got a stuff over the table that all the groups do. Y'all come over and shake howdy with us and all that good stuff. And got some hats and t-shirts. Uh, we're working on a new CD, and we're hoping to have it done. Many of you have been asking about that, so we're working really hard. But uh, with time and everything, it's been a little bit tough for us to do a crunch trying to get everything together. But we are just about to finish up on that. Matter of fact, we're going to the studio Monday, and uh, we're finishing that up. December the 12th through the 14th, we're going to be in Pigeon Forge at the Great Smokies Lodge Resort, Grand Smokies Lodge Resort, and it's going to be us, Jonathan Wilbur, and the Inspirations Quartet. So if you're down that way, bring your wife, let her shop. Amen. Let her shop. If you want that shotgun for Christmas, you better let her shop. But anyway, let her shop. Y'all y'all go out and enjoy yourselves, and then you can go to Cracker Barrel and eat supper. And then just walk right across the street at 7 o'clock each night. We'll be there with the inspiration of Jonathan Wilbur and Jeff Tauber from Primitive Road. It's always a fun time right before Christmas. And uh, it's in between the Halloween and, or Thanksgiving and, and Christmas. It's always a good little break right there as well. So we want to invite you to come and be with us on that. I would say come be with us on the cruise, but it's sold out this year. So try to get your name in the pump for that. But we've enjoyed this. We're going to do an up-tempo song. It's entitled, Didn't He Shine? And then when we finish, you up, you guys are welcome to get your instruments, come out here and help us and pick some. And then uh, we're going to end up with another song here before we close out tonight. Yeah. When he came to a lonely manger, didn't he shine? When he came to a lonely manger, didn't he shine? There was just one reason why. He came to earth to die. Oh, this precious rose was shed. Didn't he shine? When Jesus cried, Father, forgive them. Didn't he shine? When he cried, Father, forgive them. Didn't he shine? Early on that Sunday morning, a new world was dawning. When he rose up from the grave. Didn't he shine? Well, didn't he shine? When my soul was out in darkness, didn't he shine? Oh, but when I cried for mercy, I felt his arms around me. When he saved me, hallelujah, didn't he shine? Now on that resurrection morning, he's gonna shine. Resurrection morning, he's gonna shine When he comes in clouds of glory We'll be glad we heard the story On that resurrection morning, he's gonna shine Now when they crown him Lord of Lords, he's gonna shine And when they crown him King of Kings, he's gonna shine And won't that be a happy day When at last we're home to stay When they crown him Lord and King, he's gonna shine Will he be shine? When my soul was out in darkness, didn't he shine? Oh, but when I cried for mercy, I felt his arms around me. When he saved me, hallelujah, didn't he shine? Oh, but when I cried for mercy, I felt his arms around me. When he saved me, hallelujah, didn't he shine? Didn't he shine? Sounding good over there, way. <clears throat> Y'all come out. Y'all come on out here. I think this would be appropriate this evening. I...
It's been a wonderful evening, and uh, we've enjoyed this so much. Thank y'all so much for coming out and being with us. And uh, we'll get everybody to come up and sing this. And I don't know, once we get done singing this, they got all these instruments. I want them to come out on that one there, but when we get done singing this, we might do a little bit of circle being broken or something together as well. But uh, I felt led to sing this tonight. You know, all the groups have done such a great job and everything, but I can honestly probably, I, I don't know all of them, but my spirit bears witness with them. And I could say probably for all of these that stand on stage this evening, if there's anything that we could do, it's not about how we hold an instrument or what, how we pick or how we sing or how we look <laughs> or anything like that. <laughs> I got to kid you a little bit. But it ain't nothing about that. It's about our Savior and uh, being able to lift Him up in a way that people would desire Him. And uh, pray for these groups and pray for us that we might do our best to lift Him up. But uh, Jeff, real quick, uh, before he sings this song, Saturday, September 28th, if you enjoyed this singing tonight, we'll be having a singing over at Lebanon at the Government Center, and it is a benefit. Every dime goes to Harvest Child Care Ministries Orphanage. And we will have uh, Gospel Union, of course the Hubbard family will be there, uh, Labor of Love will be there, Johnson family will be there, uh, to name a few, but there'll be some more groups. Dinner starts at 4 o'clock, and singing starts at 5 o'clock. So if you can, Saturday, September 28th, at the Government Center in Lebanon, come and be with us. And also, uh, next Thursday, we're going to be in Bristol. Bristol's not far from here, is it? Uh, we'll be in Bristol over there with Brother Ralph Sexton in a tent meeting. So if y'all get a chance, come over and be with us next Thursday. We'd love to see you over there as well. But as I was saying, if we could sing a song this evening that would uh, lift him up in such a way, I wish we could, we've said this many, many years, I wish we could stand on the steps of the White House and sing this for sure. And if you know it, sing along with us. Well, every hope that I have here in this whole sinful world is
only one thing will matter when the time shall come to die. spirit we felt here tonight. My hope is absolutely in that precious blood Amen. that was shed on the cross of Calvary 2,000 some years ago for me, for my sins, and yes. for yours. Amen. What a Savior we serve tonight, folks. What a Savior. If you're born again, you know what I'm talking about. If you're not, you can be born again and find out all about Jesus. Yes, sir. The Bible said that we should taste of Him and see that He is good. Yeah. And He is good, folks. If you're here and don't know the Lord, you need Him. Thankful this family circle won't be broken.
this body that you are holding. Lord, I hate to see her go. Everybody say, will the circle be unbroken? My Sing the songs of childhood and hymns of faith have made us strong. And the song that our father taught us as the angels sing along. Let me hear you now. Y'all be safe out there. We love you. Thank you so much for sticking with us to the end. Did you enjoy that? Thank y'all for coming. We're going to try to do this again about this same time next year. So y'all make plans. Mark it on your calendar. And we'll get up a, a good lineup to, to come and sing for you.